Hello guys, today I'm gonna show you how you can display your FPS and graphics graphics card usage and CPU and temperatures, everything that you want from MS Afterburner in your games. So let's get started. The first thing that you have to do is to download MS Afterburner. Is just go on your favorite browser, go to Google and type in MSI Afterburner. and go on the official site i do recommend to download from this site from the official site and nothing else so this is the official site so let's scroll a little bit down and click on download after burner so after we've downloaded the ms afterburner setup you have to extract these files if you cannot ex extract these files you have to install WinRAR program to extract them or 7-zip or similar program that can extract files so right click on it and extract here and now we get this setup and double click on it click on yes if you get that user account control so here click on ok choose your language click ok next I accept agree next and make sure this Riva Turner statistic server is ticked if this is not ticked this will not work so make sure this is ticked just like I have it here go next next and install Now install the Riva Tuner, click OK. Go next. And go next, everything like this. Install. And you can just untick this and go MS Afterburner, finish. And now that we're in MS Afterburner, we go to this gear icon, settings, and here go to monitoring. And here we can choose whichever we can we we want to see in game. So GPU one and GPU two. This is GPU two is my second graphics card so i want just from one to see gp1 temperature and go to show on screen on screen display make sure this is ticked and choose whatever other settings do you want that you want to be displayed so i'm going to choose the cpu gpu and temperatures You can even choose the name of the of the statistic. So here for CPU, you can put your name of CPU and it will display the name of CPU. Or you can put percentage CPU percentage and then we will display automatically your CPU name. Or for GPU, just put uh, instead of C, you put G and it will be displayed for graphics card. Click OK. After you have done everything and you are satisfied with the settings, click OK and launch your game. But first, see if the Riva Turner is on. Make sure this program is on in the background and is show on screen display here. And you can even choose to display zoom zooming the so you can see it better and bigger so 
just do the settings that you want. Make sure they are running in the background because if they are not running in the background, you will not be able to to use the MSI Afterburner. So let's launch our game. And there we go. As you can see, I can see my GPU temperature usage, my RAM memory usage in this game currently, and CPU temperature, everything that, that and CPU usage, everything that, that I selected before in that boxes that you choose and tick everything that you want. Then you will see here. So And that's how you see on MSI Afterburner your statistics from your PC in game live. So make sure the MSI Afterburner is is running in the background because if it's not, then this will not work. Like and share the video if this helped you and see you in the next video. Bye.